Number three, get that hose on that ladder. Okay, that should be enough. Number one, unlock, climb in. It's a very rewarding career. I'm glad to pass along the knowledge I have and the experience that I have to our students. You're going to find that door. He's going to so we have a nice sound. balance of the door. technical skills, as you see here, with the uh, hands-on training. Then also in our associate degree program, we have the technical knowledge that enhances that. Set up like you would for a rural water supply. What We've got excellent facilities here. We've got excellent instructors. And there's really no more friction points. No friction. We so pretty much tailor our program around students' needs. To your friction point. We stay very current on what's going on in the fire service. Try to keep everything up to date. Going through the program is where I get all the knowledge from. And then serving on a part-time volunteer department allows me to apply that knowledge and turn it into experience. The instructors at school are really great and they can open a lot of doors for you, but ultimately it's the student's responsibility to cross through those doors. I'm going to open the door a little bit. One of the things that I like to do is make our students not only knowledgeable, but also train them to learn. Here comes the nozzle. So that they're always looking for new things, new trends, new hazards that are going to affect their lives in the future.